hello there. What's up, everybody? So, hi, my name's Kirsten. I'm the online ladies fitness coach, and generally my YouTube channel is all about fitness, nutrition, healthy, fun, fucking stuff. But so many of you wanted to see my new place that B Mark Fit and I just got. We were in a two bedroom condo for honestly, I can't even talk about it because it gives me uh, it gives me PTSD. Is that the right word? <laughs> it was so during the pandemic with us and like our live stream. So we got a new place. It is probably about five times the size and I'm going to give you guys a tour. So this is Kirsten Cribs, Kit, no, Cribs, Kirsten style. Fuck, why was that so hard? <laughs> and then because I love sharing my food diaries or giving you guys just like insight on what you need to eat to fuel your body, I'm going to show you guys my fridge. So Kirsten's house, Fridge at the end, I'm gonna show you guys my first meal plan in my new place. Let's go, I'm so excited. Hi guys. <laughs> <laughs> this is the garage. The garage is as big as the entire house. It's huge, so um, come on, hurry, hurry. This is Brian's car. Sometimes he lets me drive it. It's his baby. When I drive it, I feel extremely cool. The garage is huge, so I don't even know if you're going to be able to see the extent of how big these garages is, but there's a couple storage units, um, there's a bathroom in the garage, it is sick. So over here, this is where I'm going to be doing all my live Zoom camps, all my live trainings. I actually think I might set up a little desk down here. I get distracted very easily, so down here if I have my desk, I could just focus. So all of my weights, everything here. If I'm like, oh my God, I'm doing a live stream and I have to go pee. Oh, what? There's a bathroom in the garage. So the garage is sick. I love the garage. It's so awesome. I needed a space to do my live workouts where it didn't annoy Haley or my fiance. So this is absolutely perfect. Um, and you can see like I can fit my car in here as well. Storage, storage. Um, Bomi, we'll just take these stairs upstairs. Right, Bomi. Actually, fuck this. Let's take the elevator. <laughs> Yes, that is right, folks. We have an elevator in the house, so open up. You just have to hit call and then it zooms on down to where we are. Let's freaking go. Close it. So we are on floor one and we are going up to floor two. So we're going up to the where Brian's office is. There's a bathroom, our kitchen, our dining room. Brian, my beautiful fiance, furnished the entire thing, so it's all brand new and I'm like, going up. <laughs> Show them how you can see the thing, look like, how cool that is. And we have almost arrived to our final destination. Three, two, one. Welcome to the mother trucking kitchen, boss babes. Let's go. All right, we've arrived, folks. So elevator stairs, this calorie burn, this when you're lazy AF, you come home drunk, you can't, it's dangerous to walk up those stairs. If you are drunk, you should not be walking up those stairs. So then you take the elevator. If you're like, I'm healthy, I wanna lose weight, take the fucking stairs, okay? That's what's up. All right, so guys, this is the clock that Brian bought. I like it, looks good, right? Mm -hmm. This is our new furniture living area, a nice little, I think you call that an accent on the middle of the table <laughs> right there. Our TV, some cute pictures of my beautiful, cute little squish butt. Look how cute she was when she was younger. I'm she not still, cute anymore. You're beautiful. Are you kidding me? <laughs> come, come honey, come hither, come hither. You're beautiful. <laughs> this is my offspring. She's 12 and she's almost as tall as me. So we haven't actually furnished the patio yet, but there is a patio. So I'm super excited because from about 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. there's Brett and you should come for mimosas. Or yeah. something. There's literally so much sun on the patio from 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. So you can just come out here, do your work, eat, drink, and be merry. Oh, fluff, and if fluff jumps off, then he dies. So get inside. This is the kitchen. This is our new dining room table. So if you have watched Brian's uh, live stream, so see him sitting in a chair that was half fallen apart. I had the same, uh, the same hand-me-down table for 15 years. So it was literally like. I can't even explain. Someone said on Brian's live stream, they're like, dude, get a new fucking chair. I'm like, it's horrendous. So, new table, bar stools, kitchen, kitchen, kitchen. It's so much bigger, so much room. This is what I'm gonna show you guys after. I'm gonna show you guys what I filled my fridge with for our first grocery shop. Lots of space. This is Brian's office. Babe, say hi, show them your office. This one? 
This is my office. So what is your desk? This is my new desk. A lot of really cool things happen here. This is my water bottle. I drink out of it. This is my speakers, and they have lights that come out of it. And this is my desk, and it matches my chair. And what's that behind you? There's a light. And what do you do with that thing? I use it to, on my face. Yeah. <laughs> He's special. This is the downstairs bathroom. So. One thing I love about the house, and this is in the kitchen too, is the countertops. They're so sparkly. I freaking love them. Um, we have to get, I'm going to show you guys the bathroom upstairs, but we have to get some curtains for up here. But we immediately found the cutest ones that match the house perfectly. So this is where you either have to go pee, maybe you have to take a crap, whatever you have to do down here. We got a bathroom for you. All right, so I'm making Brittany take the stairs and squatting. Go, Brittany, harder. What are you doing this for? What is your why? Do you want to look good in a bathing suit? Go, squat low. And um, meanwhile, I'm gonna take the elevator. Follow me. Brittany, I'll meet you upstairs. I'm just taking the elevator. Do one more set of stairs, okay? Oh, Go okay. hard. Why are you doing this? How do you want to feel in a bathing suit? You want to look good. You want to feel good. You deserve this. Squat lower. Just waiting for we're just waiting for the elevator so you hit this little this little call button and then the elevator comes to pick you up oh it's here let's go so up to the third floor where the magic happens our bedroom let's go ah, going <laughs> now you feel <sighs> oh my god that's what Brittany was squatting while i took the elevator so i'm proud of take you take the elevator take the elevator Third and final floor. So guys, this is where I wash my clothes. This is where my nasty ass drip fit is literally. Oh, smell that. I'm putting it on you. It's sweaty. Girl. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I washed it. I washed it. I, I, I actually put it in the shower with me. So this is where we wash our stuff. I always hang my Lulu alive. There's some laundry down there. There's some uh, foot soap. If you have stinky feet, you can just put a little bit of that. It soothes them and so softens corns and calluses. So if you have corny feet, Johnson's foot soap. They should fucking be paying me for this. Johnson's, if you watch this, it's fucking a thousand bucks for that promotion. Okay. Shh, come here. Babe, put your clothes on. <laughs> this is where the magic happens. Woo! So B Mark again got us a brand new bed. What the heck is that? It's like a little piece of flap. So it's a brand new bed. Do you like it? And then we got our TV set up. So we still have to put up all the pictures. So this guy here I need to repaint and put up here. Um, but yeah, it's super spacious, super awesome. We got a nice big closet, which I organized. Brian furnished the place, so I committed to organizing everything. This is all my, this is all mine, this is all mine, this is all mine, and then Brian has this. <laughs> I need, more. I have so many clothes, and that's just the way it is. So we still got a few things to set up over here. We're gonna put, love is always the answer above the new bed. That'll look cute, right? Let's test it out. Oh my God, yes, right? Yeah. Well, that looks so cute. We've got a nice big bedroom, so it can be. Oh. I just broke it. I just broke it. I just broke it. I just broke it. I just Shit. Shit. Don't tell Brian. Don't tell Brian. Shit. 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 I fixed it. He'll never know unless he watches this episode, and now I just have to get down. Oh my god. Ta da! Ooh, that was scary. I'm fucking calling the landlords about that one. <laughs> All right, guys, we got the bathroom, and then we got Miss Haley's room, which she wanted to save for last for the finale. So, again, countertops. I love one thing that I wanted 120% was a mirror for me. And a mirror for Brian. Believe it or not, Brian takes just as long as me to get ready. I bought little matching towels, so it's light gray. It's accent, I believe that's what you call it. Mwah, voila. There's a bathtub. It's where I take a bath. I relax. I chill. Um, Show us. Awesome. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Is there sensors on YouTube? <laughs> Play slow music. And then I'll be like... <laughs> da, na, 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 na. <laughs> stretch my shirt still up how horrendous <laughs> scoop and slay and then we hop over to the shower where I bathe myself so 
two different heads for your liking like the smaller head. Go for it. You like the bigger head, a little bit more pressure on your body. Use that one. Yeah, guys, I match the towels. Ooh, that's scary. I match the towels to the wall. So again, like another accent. Uh, yeah. <laughs> This is the bath. This is our bathroom. It's just a little small little bathroom in there, and then we have these beautiful paintings that go up in the wall. So there's one, and this one reminded me of Brittany, so I bought it. Oh yeah, I can see like, it. It could be you. Yeah, it could be you. That's me. And that's me. <laughs> so when I'm taking a piss and pooping, then I can look at those and enjoy myself. Ooh, that's it, guys. Now we go to Haley's room. All right, welcome to Haley. Well, it's not really Haley's washroom. It's kind of like a public washroom, but it's close to Haley's bedroom. So Haley has all her special skincare products. Florence by Mills, her favorite Millie Bobby Brown, who we might meet in March if she's a good girl and doesn't give me sass. This is her makeup fridge, hashtag girl boss. But for skincare, you guys can tell that she is my child fully. I birthed her. How do I open this, Haley? You have to hold it. You have to go like this. There's nothing in it yet. So nothing yet. So there's a little skincare fridge so you can keep your skincare all clean. Then this is the, these are the shower curtains I was telling you about. There's gems. There's gems. These are real gems. Diamonds. Gold. Real diamonds. Real diamonds. And then, of course, Haley takes really bad crap, so she likes to have an ah. I'm just joking. Spritz, spritz. Carry on. Woo. Look, you come to the best part. There's my bedroom. It's amazing here is my poster and then here's where my other poster is gonna go and then my other one it's amazing if this is my new bed you know and who got are, you your new bed my mom which is amazing <laughs> so here are my legs they're amazing i can change colors um yeah um this is my little mirrors and photo wall thingy Haley designed this all herself, you guys. So it's like, it looks, that wall looks so cool. Do you want to show them the closet, babe? No, uh, we will not be looking at the closet, unfortunately. What's your favorite part of your room? My Stranger Things poster. So Haley is obsessed with Stranger Things, like to the point where if she saw Millie Bobby Brown, this is Millie Bobby Brown, she would, I, what would you do? I would cry. She would cry. I don't know, I used to call her Billy Millie Brown, and no. you would get really mad. Yeah, what about I would get really Billy mad. Billy Bobby Brown. Okay, well, now... We love our new home and we love each other. Smile for the camera, smile. Love. This is love. This is family. Thank you for coming. Peace, love, and protein. Thank you. Oh, Thank we're done. Thank you for coming. Okay, okay, all okay. right. Thank I love you. Coming. Love you. Bye. 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 What the hell? Fluff, how do you like when you have sit down, sit down on your butt? Sit. Okay, guys, he's usually better than this. Oh, sit here. Sit on your butt. Okay, he's gone. Love you, Fluff. Ooh, not yet. So as promised, I'm gonna show you guys my fridge and my first meal plan for the week in the new house. So I got all my chicken preps, prepped, barbecue chicken, honestly. Mm, grilled to perfection. And then my potatoes, all cooked. I have an obsession with these bag salads. They're so good. I wanted to keep it simple for the first day. Mm -hmm. Little turkey pepperoni sticks as a snack. Um, for breakfast, back bacon. Super easy to cook. Sprouted bread, which is in the cupboard. Eggs. Kept it super simple. And then I always go to Nature's Fair and get my favorite smoothie, the glowing smoothie. What I'm going to do for you guys is I'm going to show you my fitness pal, how I entered my meal plan for the week. Obviously, my name is Kirsten. Your name might be Felicia, it might be Sarah, it might be Christina. So my meal plan isn't gonna work for you because your body is different and you have different goals. But what it will do is show you the system I use. I'm choking on a grape. Every single week, I always pre-plan my meals out. I'm always prepped and I always put it in my fitness pal so I know that I'm hitting my protein goal. All right, guys. So as promised, I'm gonna show you guys my food diary for my first week in the new crib so I can actually go... Here it is, bada bing, bada boom, bada bang. So for my first week in the new crib right now, I am keeping myself in a small deficit. I'm working on 
fat loss, which I'm actually doing quite, quite well. I'm toning up quite nicely, so I'm super proud of myself. So my maintenance is around 2,000 to 2,100 calories. If I want to maintain my weight, if I want to lose some pounds or drop some fat, then I generally have myself around 16 to 17. So that's where we're at right now. So sprouted bread, a lot easier to digest than white bread. Um, so I always, I always go for sprouted bread and it never makes me feel bloated or gross. Two large eggs, four pieces of back bacon and some grapes for breakfast. Um, my favorite smoothie, which I get from Nature's Fair, it's the glowing with two scoops of collagen. So one thing that you might not know about collagen is there's actually about six to nine grams of protein per scoop. Um, so I get it with two scoops of collagen. It's also really great for your skin. It's good for your joint health. Um, it's awesome. So next, dinner, chicken breast. I don't actually eat canned chicken breast. This is just plain chicken breast. Mini potatoes and sweet kale salad. And then my snacks, I always have smart butter popcorn and turkey jerky. So that's my that's my um that's my food diary for the day. And if I go into nutrition, you can guys can kind of see my macro breakdown. So I'm trying to eat around 130 to 140 grams of protein each day. Um, usually around 180 to 190 grams of carbs. Carbs are not your enemy. Um, sugar, I do like to keep under 50 grams daily. I did go a little bit over today, but um, in foods that have more natural sugars, so not as bad for us my fibers on point and then i try and keep my fat under 50 g yeah yo i don't know what i did oh my god babe how do i fix this <laughs> yes. Did you? yes i did <laughs> Swear on mine in your life and Bailey's really I didn't put the fan on, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm hungry. I'm hungry. I just want to eat my freaking breakfast. <laughs> this is what happens when you don't eat until 10 a.m. I'm pissed, the fire alarm went off. Thanks for tuning in, guys. This has been an episode of Cribs, Cursed and Sal. I'm just kidding. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. That's my new place. I've never lived in a place like this before, and I'm so grateful for my beautiful fiance, and there were so many people that voted on the poll, so I decided to make an episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you got value out of seeing how my meal prep looked for the week, and um, don't forget, if you're a lady and you want to join my free fitness community, the link is in the comments. If you are a lady and you're ready to take your fitness to the next level, you're ready to join a team of over 350 ladies, the Big Booty Boss Academy, the BBBA, where we scoop and slay. All you need to do is click the link below, join the family. I would absolutely love to have you. Peace, love, and protein, baby.